days in my life type of vlog this week is very exciting as you probably already know from the title i will get into that later james and i well hold on let me backtrack this morning went to pilates as you saw made a really yummy breakfast i still haven't showered um i've been doing pilates every week like a couple times i've been trying out a few different studios using class pass so if you want to try out class pass i think they're doing two free weeks right now that is like i get my facials through class pass i do yoga through class pass I used to do all my spin classes through ClassPass, but now I work there, so I have a membership. Um, but I've been trying out all these Pilates studios through ClassPass, which is such a great way. Like, if you even if you do eventually want to get a membership at like a yoga studio or fitness studio, ClassPass is so great because it lets you try out different places. Because it's kind of hard to commit to just one, especially in San Diego. There's so many places nearby. Sorry, the plane. So I'm just trying to figure out which one I actually want to commit to because I think Pilates is gonna be like at least a weekly thing for me. I'm still gonna be going to the gym and all that, but I do really like Pilates. It's so hard and humbling because I'm lifting weights all the time and I do Pilates and I'm like, oh my God, I can't do anything. I don't know. Also, we just got some kombucha, got my own little cup, but we also get these growlers every week because James stopped drinking coffee. So he like has been drinking a lot of kombucha. I'm in a shower and get the day started even though it's already very much started. <laughs> Hello, there's been a gap in time. It is now evening time. I worked this evening and I also didn't really do much today. I was just like on my laptop doing stuff. So it wasn't very exciting. <laughs> but we're making Green Chef for dinner because this video is sponsored by Green Chef and actually James is cooking because I cooked last night. The Green Chef that we had last night was, wasn't it so good? Oh yeah. So good. Tonight we are having this roasted veggie couscous bowls, which they look very good. <laughs> Ow. They look very good. All right, get to work. You guys know the drill. You know that I love Green Chef. So Green Chef is a CCOF certified organic company. They have options for every lifestyle, including keto and paleo, vegan, vegetarian, fast and fit, Mediterranean, and gluten-free. They actually now offer even more variety and flexibility than ever before with double the choices. So you can now choose from all 24 recipes weekly with the option to mix and match meals from different preferences. So like you can get vegan one day, keto the next. Their always changing variety of easy to follow recipes means that there's always something new to discover each week. So you never get bored, which is something that I love about it because I feel like I'm always trying new things from them and it's so much fun. I get so excited to look at the menu. Green Chef, of course, saves you lots of time by taking care of meal planning, grocery shopping, and most of the prep for you week after week so you don't have to. So if you'd like to try out Green Chef for yourself, you can use my code 135ANGELINA to get $135 off plus free shipping on your first box. Go to greenchef.com for more details. Morning. We are going to the gym. I don't know why, I don't know what I'm saying right now. We're going to the gym. My hair looks a little bit crazy. I'm hitting legs and glutes today, which I feel like I haven't done in a while. And I'm wearing this set from Bow and T. Shoes are Nike, Nike blazers. just finally heard back from the person who I've been in contact with for the rabbit adoption agency or organization and she said that I can go pick him up now. It's been a very long process. You had to go through like different interviews because they were really trying to make sure like people know how to take care of rabbits because rabbits are pretty complex pets. You know, if you're new here, you might not know, but I had a rabbit named Dirtle and he passed away in February, but I feel like I showed him a lot on my channel. He was like literally my best friend. He would sleep in bed with me and you know, it's been like what five months now since he passed and I've been really wanting to get another one and I've been looking on websites every day rescues obviously adopt don't shop and 
yeah, I've been looking at him for a while and went through the whole process and I finally get to pick him up and I'm so excited. I got him. I got him. You a little bit scared to come out? Yeah. That's okay. You have a whole world to explore and you have all the time to do it. Hi. Hi. You're just a baby, but you look like Hi. <laughs> I know, you, <laughs> He's so big. Look at big paws. Babe, look how big he is. I can't get over it. <laughs> oh my god. Hi. 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 I wouldn't even pet him yet. You're Mr. Melty Boy already, huh? Yeah. He's Mr. Melty Boy. Okay, so he's in the room right now. James and I are just gonna let him chill because he seems a little, I mean, he's probably very confused. I'm assuming his first time in a car, maybe not, but the car ride and now he's in a completely new place with all these new sights and sounds. So I think we're just gonna let him chill out, relax, get used to the room, maybe eat some food, drink some water, whatever he needs to do. Um, I'm gonna get some work done out here and then I'll give you guys an update. I gave him some greens. He has like food and water and everything. I just want him to adjust to the new environment. I don't wanna overwhelm him. Because obviously I'm like an extra added factor. I'm a completely new person. He doesn't know who I am. So just gonna let him chill out for a little bit. Okay, you get a couple beers. Do your laundry. Let's celebrate getting a rabbit. Okay, so it's been a few days now. We've had Reggie for a few days and he's gotten so much more outgoing and less shy and scared. He's like super used to us now, but I wanna show you guys, I'm gonna wrap up the vlog, but I wanted to show you guys, like give a little tour of his space because I feel like I didn't really do that. So I will show you guys right now. Okay, so here's Reggie. Oh, are you a little whiskey? Um, okay, so this is his little spot. I have a big rug for him. <laughs> so that it's like soft. And then he has a bunch of toys. So he has this chew toy, these little hoops that he actually has already, they were all attached and he actually already like ripped them, chewed them through, which is good. And this is an ice pack that I put in some um, pillowcases and he, cause he gets really hot. Yeah, that's a good boy. He's laying on them now. Good job, good job. Um. This little teepee, I will link this teepee because I'm so obsessed with it. It's actually like meant to be for cats, but obviously he's like the size of a cat, so it's perfect for him. He likes to lay in it. This little chew toy, I just hung it up there, but um, they actually gave this to me from the shelter. This is his litter box. It's like a jumbo sized one with obviously litter and hay, lots of hay for him. And then this little food bowl and this water bowl that I got from the um, dog and cat sections because the rabbit bowls are just too small for him. Also, I just completely forgot to mention. Um, so the reason he's so big is because he's actually a Flemish giant. They don't know if he's like full, full blooded Flemish giant, but his mom's Flemish giant. They don't know who the dad is. Um, here, I'll let him out if you want to go run around. So he's only six months old and he's already 11 pounds. <laughs> and they don't reach their full size until about a year and a half so we actually have no idea how big he's gonna get which is really fun i'm gonna get him a wellness exam soon so hopefully they'll weigh him honestly i feel like he's already gotten bigger since we've had him which is crazy like his paws are so humongous but i love him so much and chews on literally everything <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna end the vlog here. It's already a new week, so I'm probably gonna vlog this week. So I'm back on my YouTube game, you guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's obviously very exciting for me. If any of you guys are like, if you guys remember Dirtle, um, you know like how special he was to me. And so just like having <laughs> another rabbit in my life is so, it just means a lot to me. Like I, Dirtle was literally my best friend and I already love Reggie so much. And like rabbits are just, 
the greatest pets ever like they bring so much joy to my life so I'm just super super happy it's like I felt like something was missing and now that I have Reggie I feel like complete again if that makes sense so yeah I can't wait to share more of him with you guys so I'm sure he's gonna be in like every single one of my videos honestly because he's like always around and he's such a big part of my life already so thanks so much for watching love you guys and I'll see you in the next one